There it goes. 3 1. Been playing Tyler Tasmanian Tiger today. Classic. I haven't actually played the Steam remake, except to make sure the con except to just load it up and make sure the controls are all fine. So, uh, auto save, blah, blah, blah. Gilly, the Bunyip Elder. Get I might? It's time you knew the truth. Years ago, a great battle was fought over the fate of five mystic talismans. Challenge Boss Cass were trapped in the dreaming. Mom? Dad? Word grows that Boss Cass is seeking out the talismans again. He must be stopped at all costs. It's up to you to find the talismans before he does. It's up to me to save my family. Oi, Ty! Are you okay? Murray? Oh, am I glad to see you. Oh, you're never gonna believe what just happened. I was playing in the forest when the ground suddenly... That's when you showed up. Right. Sounds like you've got a fair dinkum adventure ahead of you, mate. Not that I'm into that sort of thing. I'd much rather be at home watching the footy. But I tell you what, you do the adventuring and I'll help you out where I can. Sure. Welcome to Rainbow Cliffs, mate. By the way, whenever you see one of these signs, I won't be far away. 
I've heard that if you press the action button, you can talk to me, whatever that means. Okay, now let's get down to brass tacks. If you're gonna be out adventuring, then you'll need another boomerang. And I know just the place to find one. <laughs> Head down to Bly Bly Station. I'll meet you there. Sure thing, Mike. I used to play this way, way back when it first came out on the original Xbox. And then I saw it had a, well, it says HD remake, but I'm not seeing all that much difference. Uh, well, of course I got to talk to Julius first. G'day Julius. Now, if I just reroute these wires to... I said g'day mate. I is death. Oh, goodness graces me. Oh, I didn't see you there. I was just making some last minute adjustments. Well, 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 you must be Ty. Can I? So, you old coot. <laughs> What's this contraption do? Open the portals. <laughs> this contraption is the key to finding the talismans. Why is this so? It's quite simple, really. It uses an oscillatory microfeeder to scan for trace energy signals that match the unique power matrix of the talismans. Mm -hmm. mm, like a big nose yeah. that sniffs them out. Oh. Ah. And thunder eggs are the key to powering the machine. Thunder eggs? Oh, they're as rare as hen's teeth, mate. Couldn't you just use batteries? <sighs> if only it was that easy. You see, this machine doesn't just find where the talismans are, it actually teleports them here. Struck me lucky. Now that number and that, my friends, requires a great deal of energy. So, uh, how is Ty here gonna find all these thunder eggs? Hey, I was just wondering that myself. A reasonable question. I've created these portals to lead Ty to areas rich with them. Of course, they won't just be lying all over the place. The just our luck. A lot of them will have already been found. The trick will be convincing the locals to part with their prized possessions. But I'm afraid I can't help you with that. If you're as resourceful as they say, Ty, I'm sure you'll think of something. Righto, Ty. There's no point in mucking about. You've got to find a second boomerang. Mm -hmm. I'll see you in two up. Sure thing. <laughs> okay. We'll go to two up. This billabong has got the lot. Gum trees, wallabies, and even a koala. <laughs> There's plenty to do here, so let's get a move on. Okay. Well, it's never going to do trouble by bizarre portals. Listen, mate, I solved your problem. I found you a second boomerang. That's great. Where is it? See that tree over there? Yeah. Well, it's not there. <laughs> right. Well, where is it? It's on top of Frill Neck Peak. Oops. Oh, great. No, don't worry. You'll just have to jump, run, bring, and bite your way there while avoiding Boss Cass's henchmen. Look, mate, life wasn't meant to be easy. <laughs> right, so... Platformer, a bunch of collectibles, mobiles. If you get a hundred of 
tree or something. You get uh, a fire pit. Like that one that I'm trying to jump on. Uh, <clears throat> Beauty! Butler! Bonza! I, I got, got one! one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One down, 71 to go. <laughs> Come on, let's get a move on. <laughs> yeah. So, bites. I reckon those dunnies are a complete waste of space. Well, you would do a bird. <laughs> Only last week I used one, walked two blocks, was clobbered by a frill, and then woke up back on the dunny. Which was the best place to be, given the surprise I got. Julius reckons it's got something to do with the space-time conundrum. But if you ask me, I think it's a load of bull dust. So, you're saying that if I have an accident, I'll end up back at one of these? Yep. Something like that. Let's hit it for checkpoints. Truth time! You've got a fair set of choppers on you. I reckon you could put them to good use by pressing the bite button. Get it? It's choppers. Bite button. <laughs> In the night time. Move on. Have a go at those crates. Sure thing, Mike. Now, I was speaking to a bloke down the local water hole, and he reckons you can use your rings to take care of enemies and smash things. He's right. Shoot Ripper! He said something now, wait a minute, he said something about pressing the throw button to use them. They actually kept it in this version, but in the original, if you were missing one opal, then you'd get it when you came back into the level. If there's only one you were missing. Oh no, not more cages. Struth! What happened here? Boss Cass did this. He's caged all your bilby mates and hidden them across the land. Because he can. Oh yeah? Well, big mistake. No one messes with my mates. Now there's a thunder egg in each area if you free them. No worries. Unless you're Boss Cass. Hmm. Or one of his mates. Yeah, I can't break these except with your body. You youngins, have it easy these days. If you want to get a better look at your surroundings, just wiggle your camera stick. And you can adjust the camera distance by pressing the camera distance button. In my day, we had to get off our backsides if we wanted to see the world. Yeah, sure you do. I don't know if it's true, but I well, heard about opals. this bloke who found 300 opals, then took them to Julius's opal machine. Anyway, something weird happened, and he ended up with a thunder egg. <laughs> yeah. Righto. Oh, yeah, kangaroos. I think they only show up in about five levels. Got all these situational yeah. things. When I was a lad, there was this kid, Toothy Malone, I think his name was, yeah, who could bite his way through a dozen pies in less than a minute. 
These aren't pies, mate, but I reckon you could chomp the lot by pressing the bite button yeah. quickly. Try what? biting them quickly to reach that thunder egg. So I did on them crates earlier. Pretty sure that shouldn't be happening. might be perfect for my latest invention. Mm -hmm. The Cogulaceous Boomerangerous Extrapolator. Right, what's that? Why, it's a machine that creates experimental techno rangs. I need golden cogs to build a new one. Fifteen, to be exact. Fifteen and if you golden find enough, bring them to my lab in Rainbow Cliffs and I'll build you a new boomerang. You're Five, on, mate. Right? Fifteen golden cogs. Rainbow Cliffs. Hmm. I suppose they have to be gold because if they're anything else, they'd be able to actually reuse the damn things. But as it is, 15 gets you one new boom and then that's it. Well, well a pair of new boom rings. Uh, I can't remember what it is you get to get this certain. I mean, when you get 300 old rules, then you get the obvious fire egg at the machine. But there's a number in the, um, yeah, the, the one that's, so the point that says 1, and now says 2. I can't remember if that's supposed to be extra lives or something else. Well, that's an extra life, so I haven't asked many questions yet, so I can't get to it. Julius told me to tell you this, but I have no, no idea what it means. Apparently, according to Julius, you can lock your uh, camera up. Lock your fancy camera. Yeah, hate these guys. <laughs> Obviously, I won't be able to get all the opals in this level now because I, can't, I don't have to the swim, swimming abilities. But I'll get as many as I can. Could it, save, could it just save you progress? Like, you know how, how, pro how much you progress on the level when you exit it. Well, so if I have a certain number of opens, then let us save that for when I'm, when I come back to the level. A certain number of cogs below. Can't remember what how many. 
Yeah, 10 cogs, 300 locals. Uh, oh yeah, there's the time trial mode. I like the frills, they just sort of... You get, you get near them, they step... You normally don't get too near them, they just stand there and pull faces out there. Stuck in the rock, you just did. Show off. Well, I wouldn't have believed it if I didn't see it with my own eyes. <laughs> you actually found the second boomerang. Well, there's no time to sit around and feel all pleased with yourself. You're gonna have to put that new ring to use. You see, I had a thunder egg I was gonna give you, but a bunch of frills stolen. You'll have to take them all on to get it back. Sure. Ooh, achievement. Another thing the original didn't have. Of course, those guys still have the ridiculous little hitbox. Of course, now I've got two for some bizarre reason I can fly. Achievement for get all the things. And now, of course, I'm going to get the tutorial by sliding. Well, it looks like today wasn't a complete waste of time. <laughs> you seem to have learned a thing or two. Try it, it's all right. Ah, you know, there's one other thing I could show you, but uh, I don't lighting? know if you're ready for it yet. Yeah? Well, what's that? Well, a mate of mine who knows a mate who knows a mate who knows another mate says you can use two boomerangs to glide long distances. Mm -hmm. How? It's simple, really. You jump, then press and hold jump again to start gliding. Right. Is that safe? Of course not. Safe as ours is, mate. See if you can glide across this gap to reach that thunder egg. Good. Yeah, because yeah, see how collect vocals, find buildings, time attack, gliding. Yeah, see. Shoe ripper! Ah, look at that. Me mate's mate, mate, mate was telling the truth after all. <laughs> Just as well I didn't call for an ambulance. <laughs> well, lad, you made it through with flying colours. And as a little extra bonus, a stopwatch will appear near the start. Okay. What's that for? The racetrack. You can race the clock to win another Thunder, Thunder Egg. Right. I'll give that a go later. <laughs> well, that's enough gas bagging for me. Let's head back to the Bly Bly station. Mm-hmm. I think the achievement part might be good. Mushroom, oh yeah, mushrooms take you back to the start. Just standing them and... Um, there we go. Welcome, race to the finish as fast. The chip. Good yeah. luck. It's not particularly challenging, I guess. Good music. That 
was a ripper of a race, Ty. You're faster than a long-legged emu with a case of the belly aches. <laughs> case of the belly aches. I reckon you've earned this. Oh, you beauty! Dang it. I thought you let's go back to the World War Station. Obviously I don't have enough to buy. Still. Rainbow books. Ah. Cool. Ooh, just having I found it! Well. I found it! Let me see that. Yep. At last, a mystic talisman. It's time to move out. We got four more talismans to find. You there, fetch my bags. <laughs> Soon unimaginable power will be mine. My, mine. <laughs> Unlimited power. Okay, now that's done. Yeah, the gates are open. Okay. Well. I'll leave this here for now. Yeah, okay. yeah they're on mass control. Damn, this feels weird. Actually, yeah. yes, mm -hmm. make sure. Make sure you visit all the portals. Yeah. Uh, Julius said he needed 15 golden cards. I've only got six. Oh well. Yeah, okay. I'll leave this here. Do the next level next song. It's great. It's a great game back to old games like this. Anyway, I'm rewind. Uh, please like and subscribe. I'll see you later.